What's going on guys? So we're gonna do a little experiment. Now this is a very small sample size experiment, but we're gonna see which that has better pool rate. So we got Chilly Rain, which does have all the arts, but no trainer gallery. Silver Tempest, which has a trainer gallery, and then Pokemon 151, which I think has horrible pool rates. So without any further ado, let's get going. Now. Hello. <laughs> that was not good. Sorry, guys. Which one do you guys think is going to have the better pull rates? Oh, no, don't get me wrong. It's all luck. Especially on a small sample size like this. Let me know what, to, what set you guys actually think has the better pull rates. Of these three, it's personally Silver Tempest. Um, I mean, 151, I think, has some awesome cards. My One of my favorite sets. This Galarian Sloking, um, but pull rates I feel are awful. I mean, I open, I've opened up three of the um, collection boxes, and I think each time I've gotten two to three pulls out of seventeen packs. That's horrible. In fact, I've done it at minimum two, and I'm pretty sure three. Leads me to believe that it's pretty consistent. It'd be, I think, leaning the other way if you get something better. The Celebi V. So, that's how I feel. I, once again, Pokemon 151, one of my favorite sets. But, pull rates just aren't there. Something I think they really dropped the ball on because I think the pull rates there. Yeah, some of those cards might have a little less value. I'm not saying you have to completely make amazing pull rates, but I think you could have gotten something there. So, but that's my personal opinion. All right, Silver Tempest. Now we here we do have the chance at no code. <laughs> Look at that. Um, Trainer Gallery, which gives us a better chance at getting pulls, but once again, not a guarantee at all. These are just four random packs I had laying around. They weren't even out of the booster boxes, these were all out of either collection boxes or tins. Just loose. So, we'll see. Ooh, that's a nice card. Card I've never pulled, I don't believe. Actually, really nice. Alright, so I'm going to still have only have one pull. And it actually was from the trainer gallery. That's borderline miscut. Come on, come on, come on. Just a hollow. And our last one from Silver Tempest. As I looked at the code card because I was like, there's no way. But there was way. It wasn't good. Alright, now 151. Now these two packs are from too many tins. As a matter of fact, the last two many tins I had as a whole. So. Caterpie, Magnemites. I actually do think 151 has a slight chance at winning. Just because there were so little pulls, but I mean, hey, if we can pull that Charizard, Blastoise, or even the Venusaur, I've already got the Venusaur, but I would love the Blastoise. Obviously, the Charizard, the most valuable card in the set. The 
Trio, Sand Slash, B Drill. So there goes 110. Nothing in it. I'm thinking at the most we get one EX. One hit. Unfortunately. Oh my gosh. So bad. Like I said, horrible pool racing. You would think something. Anything, which there's still a chance. Maybe let's back magic. Maybe the Charizard's in here. I don't know. But this is horrid. Oh my god, no. Absolutely nothing. I mean, I feel like that kind of confirms what we kind of already knew is there's nothing in these. I mean, look at that. That's horrible. So, sometimes actually got second. Chili Rain got first. And Pokemon 1v1 got last. So, let me know what you guys think. I mean, I know that's... how. What do you guys think of 151 floor rates? I think they're awful. I think they're horrible. But, some really cool cards. So, let me know down below in the comments. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. See you next time.